Hi. Roe vs. Wade has now been overturned. My deepest sympathies are with women who have lost their freedom. And also my message for pro-life movement is simple. Go to hell. Your actions will have, your, will have repercussions coming to you. You will have deep nightmares as you go to sleep. So what does this mean overall? Now, it's, it's pretty obvious. This signs were obvious. I mean, Judge Clarence Thomas behaved throughout the years to the Trump appointees in the Supreme Court. Come on, we know this. State of Missouri, Texas. I mean, come on, we know this was going to come. It was inevitable and we chose to ignore that. We thought that the Supreme Court had a sense of humanity, dignity, and a, and a brain to understand that women deserve the right to have a choice and freedom. But they don't. I mean, it doesn't. I mean, look, when you have a judge like Kavanaugh, who is a total abuser, I mean, what, what, what else is going to be? I mean, you know what? This is the reality. According to Judge Clarence Thomas, there is more on the chopping block. Next on the blog, according to me, is same-sex marriage. And that's going to happen. And let me give you a bold prediction. There will be a video in the future going to happen where I'm going to talk about the end of same-sex marriage in the United States. Well, that day will come. And, that, and I want to be proven wrong. And I really, really do. Because all of these are the our 21st century requirements for humanity. Somehow, for these old-fashioned Republicans and Republicans and these douchebags, apparently it's too wrong for them. Here we are. This is the reality. So overall, this is the fact. Protesters, all people protesting, please do it peacefully. Don't act violently. Don't make the thugs from the Republicans look better. That's all I can say. So thank you very much for joining me on this show. Please share your opinion in the comment section. Thank you very much.